Alright, as you guys can see, I'm in, I'm in a northern crater, crater, which is the final dungeon in the game. But I'm not going to beat the game yet, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go train at the best spot in the game. Which is in this final dungeon. And I'm going to master my level up and materia. And then, once I'm done with that, I'll start my playthrough up and let you guys know how I'm doing. Alright guys, just an update. I've put my safe crystal right here. At the, this is my power leveling spot, so I'm gonna be using the spot to power level on the magic pots, which give me like 6,000 AP with triple material growth and 4,000 with double material growth. So um, once I'm done training here, um, once I'm done mastering all my materia, and once I get level or close to level 99, I'm gonna start my playthrough up again. But I'm gonna, I still need to get a W7 materia, so. I'm gonna go to the gold saucer after this, and I'm gonna do the, get the W summon material, and then I'm gonna record myself defeating the ruby and emerald weapon. But I'll probably be, I'll probably defeat those separately. So once I'm done with all, all those achievements and maxing out my kill, I think the only thing I have I'll have left to do is is finish the game. So I'll be starting my playthrough up soon. Okay guys, so I have all, every single material now, I just finished, um, I just finished a gold saucer. And, and I managed to get every single material there, so now I'm going to head to the underwater reactor so I can get the underwater material for when I prepare for ruby weapon. I need to morph a ghost ship for it, and then I'll have everything I need, so then I can go back to where I was in my update video that training place so that way I can finish my my uh, training to get uh, level 100 or oh, level 99 sorry and then master the rest of my material so I'll start my playthrough up once I get to the underwater reactor Okay, I think this is the right place. I'll check it out here. Hopefully I can encounter the ghost ship. Yeah, there we go. It is. Okay, so... I don't want to kill this thing. I have no idea how much HP it has. Yes! Got it! Changed into guidebook. There we go. So now I have to give this to the calm trap, to the guy in calm. So I'll start my playthrough up once I get there. Okay, so I f I'm in calm now and I'm at the calm traveler who's looking for three items. One of them is the guidebook, so here we go. Oh, it's the guidebook. Wanna trade it for this underwater materia? How about it? Yeah, it's trade. Okay then, it's a done deal. It's underwater material. Go on, it's yours. Oh, thanks, bud. Received underwater material. So yeah, that's gonna be for ruby weapon, obvi I mean emerald weapon, obviously. Cause I have to fight him underwater, so. I said. And it's already maxed out. It comes, so I don't have to max that out. All right. So now. I have to head to the final place, and that's. Well. I need to get max level and the maximum gill, as I'm very close to getting maximum gill already. I have 58.9 mil. So yeah, I'm gonna head to the northern crater to finish up maxing the rest of my material and also to get maximum level level 99. Right now I'm only level 91. I actually did a lot of training so already before. The in my update video, so yeah, I'll start my playthrough up once I'm done my mastering my materia. Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so here's what I did I have max level, level 99, and I have the maximum gill. Well, not the maximum gill, but I got that uh, gill achievement there, whatever it's called. Reach 99.9 .9 mil um, gold, yeah, so got that. And I've mastered all materia, but. I don't have the master materi material yet because if I get it, I won't unlock the master overload achievement. B 
because it takes all of my mastered material to get that. So the best way for me to that way I'll, that means I'll have to um, I'll have to master all my material again, and I'm not freaking doing that. It took me a long time to master those. So, so the best way for me to do for the be the best um, thing for me to do would be to beat Emerald Weapon. So once I beat Emerald Weapon, I'll be able to get the to get that item from him. Or I think it's the Earth Harp. Anyways, he has an item, okay? So I get, uh, I'll take that item and I give it to that Calm Traveler, what I did earlier. And then... Once I do that, I'll, he will give me Master Materia. So that I won't have to... Go to... Or what's that place called? Uh, Cosmo Canyon to get it. And make me lose all my Materia. By doing that. Because I won't lose all my material if I get it from the Calm Traveler, but I'll have to beat Emerald Weapon first, then. That's not gonna be. Well, I think it might be. Okay, he has a million HP, but I think I have a good method to beat him. Pretty quick. Thanks for watching, and yeah, I'm almost done this game, so I'll beat Emerald Weapon next playthrough. And then I will upload that playthrough and I'll beat Ruby Weapon in a separate playthrough. And then I'll have to. I think the last achievement is the end game. That's all I need. I only need like three achievements, so. I did all the grinding for the Master of Materials and other stuff. So the huge grind's over. Just gotta finish the game now. So I'll see you guys in my next playthrough. Thanks for watching.